Hello and welcome to my channel all about decoupage. Hi, I'm Veronica and today we're gonna do a well ornament. Can you believe it? A well ornament. So let's get started with it. If you have any questions after watching this video, just let me know in the comments and I will be more than happy to answer any questions you might have. So let's get started with the this time plastic ornament you can send off any imperfection if it might have and then i'm gonna paint it twice with white paint of course let it dry between each layer i am using this custom rice paper since this was a custom order for a customer so here are the images I've chose for it. My customer wanted a well Christmas ornament, but of course it can be just any plain kind everyday ornament as well. Of course, I am using my water pen to cut out the images. If you don't have it, just use small amount of water and small brush. Then I am tearing up the images in few places so it can fit better onto the ornament. Then I am applying a little bit of decoupage glue onto the ornament itself so it can hold my rice paper on the ball ornament. And then with more amount of glue, I am gluing the image on the ornament as you can see. There was a wrinkle forming, so I cut up it more inside the ornament itself. And then I am finishing gluing the whole image onto the ball ornament. I repeated this process three times, but since this was a large ball ornament, I did leave the images dry between applying the next one so i don't ruin my first image i applied and again when i saw a wrinkle forming i just cut inside the paper more and after that i just glue it onto the ornament itself so don't be afraid to play with the rice paper a little bit it can Take it, it is not as fragile as a napkin would be. And take it slowly, take your time with the image. There is no rush gluing it onto the ornament. All material will be listed in description box below. So after watching the tutorial, just go ahead and check out the links to the materials I used. As you can see on the last image, an overlap of paper is forming. So I just tear up the excess of the paper and then I glued the whole image onto the ornament. After my images were dry, it is time to paint the ornament. And as you can see, I go also into the rice paper itself. This way it makes better blending on the whole image so I don't have uh, like white spots and gray spots and blue spots for example. So take your time, play with your colors and just have fun with painting your ornaments. I must admit I am not a painter, I just really having fun with what I am doing and I'm trying to blend as good as I can. If you don't want to make 
your own ornaments that's okay too i do have an etsy shop as well where i do sell my design so go ahead and check my store if you please the link to it will be in the description box below as well After the paints were dry and I was satisfied with the paint job, I am applying my glitter decoupage glue. If you don't have glitter decoupage glue, that, that is okay. You can just skip this step. If you do, just make sure there is no excess because that will dry out white, not clear. And then of course, let the whole thing dry. Then it is time to seal our ornament. I am using my pouring glaze. Of course, you can use varnish as well. I am applying four to five layers of the pouring glaze. Let it dry very good between each layer. And this way I'm getting a nice glossy looking ornament. And a little bit of a tip make sure your brush is very soft when applying pouring glaze i am putting a nice big bow on top of my ornament so for this i am using my trusted pro bow the hands as you can see i can make a nice bow with many ribbons at once And then I am adding two jingle bells on the bow itself. So one at the front of the bow and one on the back of the bow as well. And I am gluing it with hot glue gun. I thought I was done, but then I decided it needs something like waves on the ornament and I achieved the look with crystal ice pen from Pentart. And here it is all finished, a cute plastic whale ornament. As you can see, I almost let it drop, but I caught it. So here it is for better look again. Uh, if you enjoy watching this tutorial, please do subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, please do give me a thumbs up or a comment and let me know if you like uh, different kind of ornaments, not just the classic Christmas ones. I would love to hear from you in the comments. Until next time, bye.